so good morning so we are discussing with a data structures so in today's class we are going to discuss a detail okay so in yesterday class we have gone with a decimal to binary so how you convert the decimal and decimal number into binary so that we will see in the yesterday's class so have you people got understood that particular program they are, have you understood this particular decimal to binary program or want me to tell again have you understood so i am asking you have you have you understood the particular program so shall i go with the next one so so in today's class you see so what is there in today's class we are getting into detail of infix prefix and postfix notation okay so what is i have already told you what is infix operation so operator is in between the operands then we tell it as infix okay so if the operator is in between the operands so we tell it as infix operation so if the operator is before the operands then we consider it as prefix operation and if the operator is after the operands so then we take it as postfix pre means before post means after so in means in between the operands so prefix will stands for before the operands and postfix will stands for after the operands so each operator has the precedence level so each operator we consider it as each operator will have the precedence level so operators of higher precedence are used before operators of lower precedence so before you go for the evaluation of infix or prefix or postfix so you have to go with a precision level so what is there in precision level so you have to see it here so which are the which are the precision levels so so first you will get with plus so you will be having plus and star so plus comma star sorry plus comma minus is equal to precedence of how many so it will have precedence as two and then you will have star comma slash so star comma slash will have the highest precedence so out of uh, all the participant so out of all the uh, operators we go with the arithmetic operators first so in arithmetic operators plus and minus are having lower precedence compared to star and slash so star and slash will have higher precedence whereas plus and minus have lower precedence okay so if you compare that with the parenthesis so parenthesis is having more precedence okay so parenthesis is having more precedence than any operator okay so now you understand here a plus b star c okay so how you are going to take it so that will be the concept okay so first you see so a plus b star c can be represented as a in brackets a plus b star c so b star c are within okay so in prefix in prefix so prefix means what b star c so b star c star is a, rather than star you are having open parenthesis as the higher precedence so keep in your mind so parenthesis things to be evaluated first so that is the concept i am telling so what you what you have to tell so parenthesis will have higher precedence so this one have parenthesis have will have high precedence so 
that is the concept so so you take it as so parenthesis will have higher precedence than any operator so keep in your mind so which one you will you need to evaluate so parenthesis so where if you have put the parenthesis that one is to be evaluated so that is the concept here so come for here we are taking the expression a plus b star c okay so a plus b star c come for the prefix prefix means first what you are going to do so first you are going to evaluate the expression so evaluating the expression now you see open is there a plus so here you are encountering two operators so which one will be evaluated first bracket will be evaluated first then plus here here also you see open parenthesis b star so which one will be evaluated first open parenthesis will be evaluated first then star understood but you come for the postfix expression so coming for the postfix expression now you see so star will be evaluated what is there inside this so that will be evaluated so here you see i am telling you in prefix star before star or plus open parenthesis are evaluated but in postfix the star is evaluated then the close parenthesis will be evaluated so that is the concept so here all the parenthesis then the operator in postfix first the operator then the parenthesis so that is the concept so have you understood what you are going to do it here so first you have to in prefix evaluate the expression so first you evaluate the expression and by using the parenthesis so now but in postfix expression you evaluate the uh, operator then you go with the precedence so that is now you will get explained de in detail here so now you see here see what is prefix and what is postfix so actually you will be having only infix operation here so infix i have already given so you have to write prefix or postfix so keep in your mind so if it is parenthesized what is to be done so you have to convert so see here infix is given infix is given sorry it will be given infix will be given and you generate prefix and postfix so these are the concepts okay so infix will be will be given and you have to generate prefix and postfix so for that particular thing i am taking this particular example okay so first what is the infix we have taken you see here a plus b star c minus d minus c star f plus g so this much things are there so which one you are going to evaluate so for that you have to combine now you see, uh, now i am telling you see here so what you have done so each and every first a plus b star c so you are making the parenthesis for a plus b star c as one bracket okay so next comes minus next this one is considered one so a plus b star c is one next d minus c star f plus g is one so the entire thing you are having the brackets so keep in your mind what i am telling you a plus b star c is one a part okay infix means left operator middle left operand middle operator right operand so left operand i am taking it as a plus b star c and then the operator is there operator is minus then right operand i am taking the entire thing okay so this part is one expression this part is one expression entire part you make it one brackets okay so now you come here so that's the same thing so this part is one bracket we have done so this part is under bracket so entire part we are enclosing it again to form an expression understood
So come for the prefix expression. So what is the prefix expression? First you have to evaluate. So which part will be evaluated? So innermost bracket. What is the innermost bracket you are having? So innermost bracket is A plus B star C. So A plus B star C. A plus B is the innermost bracket. Okay. So innermost bracket is evaluated. So prefix will be given as what is the prefix for A plus B? It is plus AB. So plus AB will come. Okay. So this bracket is finished. Plus AB star C. Okay. So this is one expression now. Plus AB is one operand. Star is operator. C is operand. So two operands, operands in between you are having star. Okay. So how you write it? So first you write the star. Next you write plus AB star plus ABC. So see here, I'm taking the left part here. So star plus ABC. Okay, so that will be taken, uh, that, that is considered it here. So plus AB star C will be taken as what? Star plus ABC. So star plus ABC is up to this part. Okay, so now you come for the rightmost part. So leftmost part you are having star plus ABC. So star plus ABC is there. Okay, so now you come for the rightmost part. So minus is there, that minus will come last. Okay, so come for the innermost evolution here. D minus C will be taken as minus DE. F plus G will be given as plus FG minus DE star plus FG will be taken as star minus DE plus FG. So star minus DE plus FG. So this one is one part, this one is one part. So finally you have it with minus. So minus will come here. Okay, this is the prefix, prefix expression. So understanding what I'm telling. Okay, so you have to, it will be very difficult to understand, but you have to. Okay, so first, first expression is plus AB star C. So that will give you star plus ABC. So star plus ABC is here. So minus, keep it as it is. Evaluate this part. So evaluating this part, you see here minus CD star plus FG. So that will be taken as star minus DE FG plus plus FG. Okay. So F plus FG, finally you plus minus. So this will be the prefix. Come for postfix expression. So postfix expression. So what first you evaluate this part. So evaluating this part, it is AB plus star C will be taken as AB plus C AB plus C star. So AB plus C star, what you are having here. I'm marking you C here. AB plus C star, it's coming from the leftmost part. So come for the rightmost part. So it is DE minus FG plus star minus. So DE minus will come first. FG plus will come next. So finally you added this two. So DE minus FG plus star. So finally you have it with minus. So this will be the expression. So expression you will be taking like this. So have you understood? Have you understood this example? Have you understood this example? So, so, 
so i will be giving the example write the prefix and postfix for this one a plus b star c minus d so so write the ex prefix and postfix expression for this one written Are you people there? Prefix. Prefix star is postfix. postfix expression a b plus c d minus d okay so now you come for the easy method how you generate in fits to prefix and postfix so you can use this particular method here okay so first i have taken the infix expression a plus b star c divided by c, d minus e so prefix you follow this step so first you see plus is having no brackets are there okay so if brackets is there in the question then you have to consider but here you see there is no brackets okay so first plus is there star is there slash minus so which one will be evaluated first so star and slash are to be so see here so which is to be evaluated star and slash are the higher precedence so in that which is the first one you have to move from left to right associativity so left to right associativity we take it as which is the first one you are taking star so star is to be evaluated so what comes b star c will be taken as star b c divided by d okay so now you evaluate this part so this part is taken now as star b c slash d is considered as slash star b c d so this is up to here okay so now plus star and slash are finished now you come with the next one so plus is a uh, plus and minus both have same precedence so you are left with plus and minus so don't go with this expressions so you are left with only plus and minus so according to both have same precedence so i evaluate this one so first operand is a next operand is star slash b c d okay so evaluating that one you will be taking it as a plus this part as b so when you take a plus b it you should take it as plus a slash star b c d so this will be the post prefix expression so similarly come for the postfix so b star c will be taken as b c star next you evaluate that one so next you evaluate that one with d part so evaluating that one with d will get you b c star d slash so now you start with a plus this part so a plus this part will get you this finally this is the answer so you used to learn this way so as per the order of precedence operated and made as operand and underlined okay 
So that one you have to see it here. So this is the another example. So, so these are the some of the examples. Some more examples of going with infix, prefix, and postfix. One method to start by inserting all the implicit brackets that show the order of evolution. So now you see first infix. So go for the brackets that you can easily understand. So inner bracket is to be evaluated. Which is the inner bracket here? It is A plus B. So A plus B is taken as A B star, and here it is taken as star A B. So similarly, C slash D will be taken as C D slash, and it is taken as slash C D. So this is finally you made it with plus. So again take this one. So infix expression A star B plus C slash D. So it is B C plus. First you will get B C plus. Next you will get. So first you will be getting B C plus. Next you have multiply it with A. You will be getting A B C plus star D slash. So similarly the prefix also. So you can easily convert directly between these bracket forms. By moving the operator within the brackets, moving the operator within the brackets. So this is very very important. Moving the operator within the brackets. Okay. So x plus y will be taken as x y plus or plus x y. So this will repeat this for all the operands. Okay. So this is up to infix to prefix and postfix okay so next you go with the uh, some of the conversions understood so 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 you got so you people got the concepts you got the concepts feeling easy or difficult tell is easy or difficult okay so that is up to infix okay so infix expression and prefix and postfix expression understood so those who have not given the attendance use it this particular link okay so for here i will be ending this particular class so ending the particular class continue in the monday class thank you all